as flood water swamps the fields of Slough House. Popular roadways now submerged too, blocked off to traffic. With 40 inch tires lifting a pickup truck, Kirk Bennett checked out the water levels for himself, but then thought better of it. Because the road's closed, don't they, want the we, I don't want the ticket. I just pulled the car out of there a uh, couple about a week ago that was over the top of it. A situation he found himself in again tonight, meeting up with another driver on Kiefer Boulevard who spotted a stalled out SUV in the middle of the flood water. That driver risked the rising water that reached his back bumper to check if anyone was inside. I just want to make sure there's no kids or anything stuck in there. So. But no response to his shouts. There was someone broke down here last night, a truck like mine, and I barely saw the tailgate. So I just thought I'd check it out today. Firefighters with Sac Metro Fire took over, suiting up to assess the scene. Three firefighters wading through the water with vests, flashlights, and tools, making their way to the SUV to find no one was inside. Turns out firefighters had already rescued that driver in the morning. The water was up past his lap before crews swept him away to safety in a raft. The four wheel drive alone isn't enough. You also have to have the right clearance and you have to have a lot of power to get through that. As more rain and snow makes its way through, firefighters warn the consequences can be unforgiving. The hazards out here are that it's cold. The water is even colder. Hypothermia can set in in as little as 10 to 15 minutes with the temperatures that we have in the water. This is snow melt. This is super cold water. That is an important warning to keep in mind. In fact, just a minute ago, we saw another pair of headlights on the other side of the road here. Thankfully, that person did turn around. And that driver who tried to help the stranded SUV out here, his name is Justin. He was actually on his way to a date for Valentine's Day, but he decided to take a moment and see if anybody was in that car to see if he could help. Thankfully, nobody was inside that SUV. Live in Slough House, Marley Martinez, KCRA 3 News. If his date doesn't understand that, you know what? Forget it. <laughs> Wasn't meant to be. Wasn't meant to be. All right, thanks, Marley. <laughs>